Finally, Regional Creative Director Ashley Eukness says you'll always be lucky enough to reel in a healthy and tasty seafood meal at her pick. This fish market and restaurant will customize your dish to ensure that you love every bite. From the hot crusty bread to the country club casual service, Ashley swears if you try it out, it will soon become one of your favorite hidden gems too. It's in Boca Raton and it's called City Fish Market. Hi, my name is Chef Michael Mercado. I'm the executive chef here at the City Fish Market in Boca Raton, Florida. We're a fresh seafood uh, restaurant and market. You have to have a lot of love, a lot of care in seafood, especially when dealing with good quality fish. We do provide guests with the freshest product that you can get sourced from multiple places. We try to get as much local fish that we can get. So we do get our fish in whole every day. And I think that is something that sets us apart. People get a lot of Hong Kong setups. You can get that with any a la carte fish in the restaurant. It sits on a bed of spinach with a uh, soy sherry broth with a side of rice. Also, our lobster morsels. It's a signature dish that the company started, I think, in 1972. Nowhere around here really does fried lobster, so that's really unique. The atmosphere is very homey, I like to say. Everyone's very friendly. We treat you as a family member when you're here. Me, personally, I like when people eat food to feel loved. Coming here, you know that you're gonna get great service, great food, and we really focus on not saying no and making it special for our guests. Lovely, so tell us about this place. Um, it is in Boca. It is in Boca. It's just a really beautiful spot when you walk in the door. Mm -hmm. it can... And it has a market, right? Yep. Okay. Right when you walk in the door to the right, they have um, the display cases, they have everything on ice. Um, and then they have a cutting room just to the right as well, so. I love to watch people cut Oh, fish. yeah. It's one of my favorite things. We um, wanted to catch the happy hour. We're a little bit late, but they have booths in the bar area, okay. so you still have a server and, and everything, but it's a little bit less casual than the normal. More form, casual. For, more casual, right. right. Okay. Than the more formal seating in the dining I room. I love the bay seating with the lake, I though. I felt like I was on a little lake and just eating. It was very beautiful. What's interesting, like you said, uh, by the lake, you mm -hmm. come off of the turnpike. Yep. You drive past it frequently. Would never know it's there. Never. And you go inland a bit, and you've got the lake, and you're truly transported it's to. It's literally oh. off of Glades, right? Mm -hmm. Like two mm -hmm. minutes away. <clears throat> yep. yep. So it's easy to get to. Yeah. It's it easy to get to. Hmm. All right, so what did you have? We started off with the lobster bisque and warm bread with mm. butter, so addictive. And How was the bisque? Was it delicious? It's very nice. Rich, creamy, everything what a lobster bisque should be. Uh -huh. And uh, then we went straight to the main course, actually, okay. after that. It was the house specialty of salmon and Chilean sea bass, and they do a preparation called Hong Kong style, okay. which is a dark cherry soy. You've had that mm -hmm. before. And I have, it's very good. <laughs> yeah, and uh, with jasmine rice mm -hmm. and sautéed spinach. And it was delicious, and I didn't eat all of it. And then I took some to my cat, and she's picky with seafood. <laughs> <laughs> it might be a first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good and you know what? Seafood. My it cat is. just ate the entire salmon afterwards. Well, it was, I was like, proved. yes. Well, then we, know it, then we know it's good. It yeah. is. And there you go. It is. <laughs> We have to go back. It You're was ridiculous, awesome. by the way. I love it. That <laughs> <laughs> was your experience. Our meal was uh, wonderful. The uh, server, again, uh, I'm very picky about uh, quality and the service and the experience. The server, uh, Rosa, mm -hmm. phenomenal. Constantly checked on my wife and I, uh, myself. We had the uh, little Bay Area. Same here. And I had a great uh, lobster meal, which had the uh, calamari and an appeti as the appetizer. Calamari was uh, excellent because it said crispy, and yeah. sometimes you don't get it crispy and it's you know more chewy. This was crispy, just the right amount of uh, seasoning on it. Don't know what it was, but it was delicious. The lobster was delicious. It was a stuffed lobster. I think it was like a pound and a half. Mm -hmm. nice. Plenty. They gave you the bib. I, uh, I didn't need the bib <laughs> because literally they had it all nicely prepared that sure. you could eat it with your fingers, eat it with the little fork. Delicious. You didn't talk about what you had. We started out with the, the, crispy, the crispy bread. It's delicious. It's fresh. You can tell it's fresh baked. Mm -hmm. We also had the half and half shrimp and crab cocktail, and it came with a little bit of the it's like pink. like a cocktail, right? They come, it comes with the cocktail sauce uh -huh. and then a pink brandy sauce, okay. which was really delicious to dip the crab into. Mm -hmm. And then they offer a specialty way of preparing lobster sometimes on their menu if you read it. 
not very many people are going to pick it because lobster is kind of a more expensive dish. Mm -hmm. So to get it fried, mm -hmm. you almost feel like, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it was delicious. They flash fry lobster morsels, and then they come with this amazing honey mustard, kind of spicy honey mustard dipping sauce. From there, we... That was we, just the beginning. That was just <laughs> the beginning. I ordered the scallops sautéed with the sweet mashed potatoes and green beans, and every bite was like candy. Nice. Yeah. So you all had lobster. How were the prices? Um, I mean, you ordered rich stuff, right? I, I would say another thing of being that it's a hidden gem. You're not paying the premium dollar right. of uh, you know a beachside or downtown Miami, you know, overpriced uh, uh, market. Uh, it, it was very reasonable. Desserts. I Anyone? had the two-tier chocolate cake. Wow. Yeah. Delicious. Wow. Mm -hmm. Slice of it. You just ate it up. I had a cappuccino with it. Frothy, delicious, rich. It was perfect. You had the dessert that I normally would get. Again, <laughs> I went outside of my comfort zone and we had cheesecake. And New York style? It was New York style drizzled with raspberry sauce. It was delicious. So now I've known to get outside of just the, uh, the chocolate cake or the vanilla ice cream to try cheesecake. It was delicious, New York style. I had an espresso martini as my dessert and it was phenomenal. When it came over to the table, everybody was like smelling it like, ooh, we should have got that too. So really? Okay. It well, was it was delicious. it was great. Well Ashley City's fish was your choice. Sum it up for us. A great hidden gem with affor affordable prices compared to other seafood restaurants with one of the largest seafood selections in South Florida. Fabio? It's very classy but not pretentious. A great quality seafood and it's a huge restaurant so I mean it's a great option for parties and right. big dinners as well. Here. Quality of food, service and the pricing second to none. Get hooked on the endless seafood choices at City Fish Market located at 7940 Glades Road in Boca Raton open daily for dinner and lunch Monday through Friday. Reservations are accepted and the average price for dinner without drinks is about $50.